Hey, welcome back to another YouTube tutorial. In this video, today I'll tell you how to connect your, uh, you know, your uh, Sony camera with your laptop. So what I'm doing is trying to remote control the Sony camera. So what I, what will I get is my camera quality will appear on the screen. So I'm making the screen, the laptop screen, as the screen for this camera this is uh, Sony a6400 so let's do it so for that what you have to do you have to uh, need few things you need a camera you need a wire cable like uh, for this this is uh, we put it in the charging port so this is uh, the charging cable that I have and one thing more that you need on your desktop so let's go to desktop and go to uh, Chrome in Chrome you have a search for imaging age desktop what you have to do once you see this uh, website called the creators cloud uh, slash sony you have to go in there and download it for windows for example i'm using windows so i'll be downloading it for windows if i'm using mac i'll be downloading it for mac so currently i'm using windows and you will click this and you will download it and install it once you install it you will get these three uh, or three to four icons so this is image uh, edge desktop added remote and viewer so you might get these all of these or even if you get this one the uh, imaging edge desktop you're good to go so once you're all done with the website and having a cable what you have to do is open this slot on the on the on the, uh, on the left side and insert this this way insert it once you insert it you have to plug it, in, it in, into the laptop. So once we plug it in the laptop, the, that port is not working. We'll plug it, it in another desktop. And then we will go to that. First we have to open the camera as well. We open the camera. The camera is open now, so it's in USB mod connecting. We go to OK. So we go to playback. We go to menu. Okay, yeah, uh, it's showing us a lot of options. To deal with that, you can directly open Image uh, Eagle and click on Start Remote. This way, we give it a try. If it doesn't work for you, it happens a lot of time. So what you have to do is just take out the plug it happens a lot of time so you will go to menu in menu you will go to this globe option and in here you will go to uh, this option called in, in the bag option you can see that that's a bag option in there in bag option you will go to setup for and you will you can see this option called USB connection it's closed so to open this as well we go back again we make sure there is another option reset it we go down and in here you can see control W smartphone we want to click that so first when you reach to camera click on control W smartphone in here you have to turn it off it's currently turned on so you're gonna click OK and off once you're done with that, you go back, you go back to menu, and you go to the bag options uh, similar to this one. And in here, you go to fourth option. This is the third one. I go to fourth menu. And in here, you can see USB connection is auto. We're going to click that, and we're going to click on PC remote. As that means we're con connecting it remotely. We're going to click it. And once we're done with that, with the settings, what we have to do is go back to the camera and connect it, connect the wire again. Once you connect the wire, you have to wait for a few seconds. I'm going to close all of these tabs again and I'm going to reopen them again. We've got to wait for the USB to connect. I'm going to click on a start. Once we, you click on a start, it will process it for a few seconds. We wait for the process. And you can see the options appeared. And we're going to click on number one and double click it. 
is connecting, waiting for response from the camera. So they are both trying to be connected. Now you can see the camera has been connected with my computer. So if I zoom it in, you can see there's an, uh, a zoom lobe. You can go into ultimate zooms. So you can even hit record on this camera. You can take a picture with that. If I take a picture, I'll click on picture. It will automatically can hurt. You can, yeah, you can see that, that this picture appear here. I can even turn it off and you can see I, I can take a picture again. So you can do a lot of things with the camera. Uh, you, even, you can even uh, run for a live video with this one. So if you think that uh, you learn something on how to connect your camera your, uh, to your PC with you know remotely controlling the screen. So if this video really helped you, make sure to leave a comment below. Subscribe to this channel. We'll catch you in the video. Keep visiting Tides Schooling.